Hello everybody and welcome back to Big Breakfast Gaming. My name is Mike and you are joining me for episode 12 of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Now, I've had a think and I've decided that for this episode we're going to do as much as we can of Grants Bridgeshire. Now this may take some time, but however long it is, we're going to get it done. That means activating any sync points we missed, getting any wealth, getting any mysteries, and getting any artifacts that we're able to get. I'm fully aware that some we can't because they'll probably be related to some missions at some point. If there's any raids, then we're going to give them a go. We're going to try and do them. Why not? We're going to need the material anyway. So I'm going to start right here at this point. So let's play. Nom, nom, nom. Big breakfast! Alright, so I want to head over in this direction. We are 470 odd meters away. Now I don't often do this because it becomes a fair bit of work. But I may cut the travel time out until I get to a location. Because this is definitely going to be a longer episode. It's going to take a lot more effort. And a lot more traveling. So the more I can cut out, the better. So from this point, I think we will be cutting out as much of the traveling as we can. All right, so... Here we are at the first location. Make the F offering of 10 bullhead. Right. So for this particular location, I have to have 10 bullheads. Those are fish. Which means I'm going to have to find them. I can't do that, I think, until I can do fishing. Which I won't be able to do until I've built a fishmonger's. So, that one stays for now. And let's move on to the next location. Principles led to your great nudity. To all tyrants of garb, let it be... Why are you naked? Because my uncompromising lack of clothes brings me joy. Yet my very own sect of pious nudists tossed me aside. Nudists? Those who bear their skin for pleasure. Indeed, we, we bear our skin at all times in the tradition of great Greeks and Romans. Yet some say I am too enthusiastic. Nude in prayer, at meal times, at work, in the streets and alehouses, everywhere. For Jesus loves us best as we were born. But the group sure. I founded has expelled me. Oh, if I could exact revenge, steal their clothes and render them nude forever, I would. Right. So, I'm guessing we have to steal their clothes. Fun times. Right. So this could be just a case of walking over taking the clothes, or it could be something else. Guess we'll find out. Okay, I can talk a to this person. Dane joins the rank. Greetings, Dane. This is our private celebration of skin. We are open to all who strip. Would you join us? Hmm. Okay. How does I would one be join honored the group? to join your group. Where do I place my clothes so I can start dancing? Wonderful. A new member. Simply place your clothes in that crate hidden by the tent and partake in the liberation. A the crate hidden by the tent. The of the liberated. Is that over this way? See a friend. Relax your body. No. 
that it? That's uh, it. That's the crate where we put our clothes. Feel free to store. Just put your. Hey! Stop them! Okay, I think they might be chasing me. Where do I need to go? Well, they're not chasing me. Now you're nude forever, as Winchell wanted. Okay, so let's go talk to him. There he is. Target must be on the ground. Now they will adhere to your principles. Yes! You have carried out my revenge. Wonderful. Now they must revel in their nudeness forever. If you like, I have a luminous text with my teachings. A breviary of why one must trust their body's exposed sinew. Enjoy. Be well, Winchell the chest free. Alrighty. It's one down. Next location. Right here. Okay, that's good news. So. Now, get the adrenaline upgrade. And now I don't mind what we get. Raven's loot. Sounds good. Okay. So, it's somewhere around it. It looks like it's underground. A whole bunch of people here. I've marked on the map a doorway which seems to be in the same sort of location. And there's a second doorway down here. Alright, so we can get underneath the waterfall. And I'm guessing. There's a gap here, and uh, that seems to be where we want to go. There we go. Okay, why can't I get in the water? A few little bits of uh, glitchiness going on. All right, Huntsman's van braces. So that's part of an arm set. Let's head back out. I'm going to head out of here, and we're going to go. Okay, these are the next part, so we want this, and they're right next to each other, so we'll do one after the other. Okay, so we're coming up to some wealth. Looks like it's underground. Probably in here. There's a 29 meters downwards. So we're looking at down there, okay. Let's hope I've got enough air in my lungs. Okay, that wasn't too far off. Okay, and the second item we wanted to get... Seems to be further up, so let's 
take a look. Where, where was it? Just get rid of everything on the map. So that's what we want. Okay. Where are you? 51 meters up. Looks like this time we have to climb. 40 odd. Just go up. Stop trying to go sideways. 33 meters up. Why do they put these things way up here? What what is that exactly? You can check on the map. Um, had we check the legend, it's L3. So that's a treasure hoard map. Right, so this is something like um, a map that gives you clues to something else that's of value. Okay, why do we always end up in tricky situations and places where we can't move? Alright, where is it? Five meters. Ah. There we go. Got that treasure hoard map. We'll go and do the treasure hoard maps at some point, but not just yet. All right, next point of interest. Let's go here. All right, here we are. Corruption lurks here. Coming up to cursed lands. And cursed lands, it's difficult to move, difficult to see. And what you need to do, as you can see it there, the marker will tell you where it is. That's like a some sort of talisman. And it's usually in the shape of a skull. I say usually it is in the shape of a skull. And you've got to destroy it. At this point, this one's quite easy. A lot of them are hidden. So it's hard to find. You see, once you've done it, the yeah, curse disappears. And it feels better. Alright, let's pop off to the next location. So here we are. Okay, here we are. There's a world event. I seek an alliance, one to benefit us both. This is your kingdom, you say? Indeed it is. Northex, and I am its first and reigning king, Equald. And as sovereign, I seek a keen ally to secure my strength. Kingdom? This island here? Yes, from shore to shore. My brothers and I came upon this unclaimed land some months ago and found it suited to our ambitions. Sadly, my brothers were drowned in a terrible squall soon after, along with our riches. There was an arm ring among them. To you, I offer this arm ring in exchange for my loyalty. Find the ring among the wreck, and you may call a king your friend. A good arm ring can be as important as blood to the heart. If I find it, I will let you know. Okay. An arm ring. I have to find something. I actually came to the wrong location. I aimed to go here. And yet somehow ended up here. That was pretty poor. Anyway, we're here now. So we may as well do it. So, there is... Some sort of treasure underwater, I take it. That's a letter with raven blood on it. Okay. I'm guessing there'll be some sort of wreckage. Maybe it's one that doesn't let me scan it. Alright, there's some wreckage over there. So I guess I'd say it's going to be somewhere underwater here. 
not picking anything up. Ah, there we go. Had to loot the brother. your arm ring amidst the wreckage of your ship by all that is great i cannot believe my eyes and ears now you are pledged to the kingdom of northex that will show him yeah his story doesn't add up your past is dubious i cannot trust a man who lost his brothers so easily and so suspiciously what really happened nothing the arm ring is mine mine this kingdom was to be one of the greatest in England. The ring shine has blinded you. Sounds like Gollum. Now I blind what? you with blood, you suffer. You have broken a sacred alliance with the greatest kingdoms. Damn, that's fairly strong. Whoa. Yeah, I can do that too. that, I guess. Now let's head back here. Yeah. Oh, Alright. Like How can I help you? You have lost your apples. But I have. Oh, a devilish wind took me over and I worry for them. But I've saved the finest and the juiciest. Oh, these apples explode in your mouth with the iridescent light of Jesus. What makes them special? An apple is an apple, no? Oh, I beg to differ, my friend. You see, every year we make the pilgrimage to the west. Hammer's farm. Farmer Hammer, to the west. Yes, we call him the Hammer, and his apples are fine. Have this sweet iron tinge in them. My friends have already made it back. They are surely feasting already, but... I fell on some misfortune. The cart busted. Please send me an angel, my lord. Sed tibi erit ipse benedictus. Non vivet in ignorantiae sue providentiae. Right, I'm Verbum guessing I just have to pick these up and oh, take them there. Thanks for carrying the crate. I'll be happy to share in the bounty of these apples with you once we meet up with your friend. You said we have to go west. So, somewhere around here? Follow the road, I guess. I'll share the Lord's work with you. The iron tinge, you will taste it. We all have earned it after fasting. Fasting? Is that when you lack food for your God? Yes, we show our devotion, remove distraction. But now, we give in to the fruits of our Creator's work. Sharing an apple with a friend is the most sublime experience. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it is nice to sometimes sit back and simply enjoy an apple. Well, with our fortune always changing in life, it's important to enjoy simple pleasures. <laughs> oh, I am so excited for you to see my friend and eat apples with us. <laughs> the act of walking, the pilgrimage we're going on. We will prostrate ourselves for Guthlack at the end of this glorious pilgrimage. Drown in his reward. Guthlack? Who the hell is Guthlack? Here we are, our tiny sanctuary. Join in prayer for the apples, if you like. We bob. Bob? It's the only way to piously reap the reward of our Holy Father. Praise be to him. Oh, Brother Hawthwolf! And you've made a friend as well. Good to have you back. Okay. Cult of Saint Guthlack. 
go look that up one day, figure out who that is. Alright, next location. Alright. We've got some wealth nearby, but we're in an area where we need to be a bit more careful. in there but we've got a few people that we do not want to see or do not want to be seen by so maybe we can go around them okay the entrance seems to be there No, no entrance there. Does that grab anyone's attention? to get into any fights. Alright, next location. I'm not going to bother with these question marks. I've used them before and they just give you locations, but I don't need that. So I'm not going to bother. We're going to come to the raid later on, so for now let's go and grab this mask. Alright, so here we are. It's somewhere around here in this building. Let's find our way in. Oh, that's not an entry point. Okay, maybe we need to get inside. Ah, right. Incendiary powder trap. This is one that's really good because you activate it and you fire and it blows things up. Perfect. All right, so we've got another mystery here. Let's head it. Let's find out what I they want. built the silo and managed... The barley in that silo was watered by my blood and sweat. Yes, and you get your share of silver when I sell it. But you keep most of it. Of the thousand you made last month, I got a measly 200. I deserve the extra profit. I secured the sale and managed the tax. Endless hours of negotiating. You there, Dane. Who deserves more? The worker who makes the barley or he who actually sells it? Hmm. I think it should be shared equally. The silver should be shared equally. How am I to be encouraged to make all of these deals? My endless hustle, the paperwork, he couldn't sell his own eye. The barley would never even exist without me. My barley is known across Mercia and Essex. Sebi's slush. My soul is in the mug. Hmm. Not sure the situation is strained between the these two brothers. Sure, I think it's obvious what needs to be done. Ah, didn't realize it explodes. Okay. And now the houses are on fire. Children, has your family always been this quarrelsome? 
Yes, they have. But I hope that has changed thanks to your intervention. Even if it was drastic. Thank you. Perfect. That was easy. Another world event. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, I've done these before. I shall inform the local Waffingas that he lives among them through traces of the Nephilim, the giant warriors who fought for God in their ancient time. They have left his presence here on Earth for us to absorb his light, the light of angels that have been infused throughout the Earth. I feel his power. He calls me my beloved, and I am calmed. I responded with All my right. communion. The aim of this and is to line up of his voices. the images. You gotta find the right location. Ooh, maybe up there. <laughs> to see the symbol. There you go. Strange energy here. Okay, great, another skill point. Now, earlier I got two more. So, let's add those three that we got. I think I'm gonna go with one of the new skills that was up here. Loot food. Higher chance of looting food. Arrow looter. Greater chance of looting arrows from archers. Long shield brace. Do you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go with a few of these skills that we got here. Uh, let's start filling out. Getting a bit more stronger. And let's head to the next location, which is right there all right so we've got another cursed land where is it 18 meters down oh great all right here we are let's just give a scan make sure there's nothing around Grab a few of these. Oops, disturb some dead bodies. These things happen. Alright, there it is. And there we go. And that's another two skill points. Let's add those. Excellent. Ooh, what's that? Berserker's metal. Interesting. Okay. And let's head to the next location. I do not want to fight zealots yet, so I'm not going to. I'm staying away from them. Okay. Grandfather's wallop is like none other. All it takes is one. His fist is a glorious. Oh, such a fine wallop it is. Little ones, what is this wallop you speak of? It's our grandfather, and be careful unless you want a walloping. I am certain my might could clove his wallop. Many cowards have said the same. He uses only one fist, one wallop. Boom! Like a wolf. Howling with its knuckles. Well, this wallop has me curious. Ha! Good. Destiny is coming to your plate. Grandfather? There's someone looking for a walloping! Hello! Yes, I have overwhelmingly powerful strength, but it is not worth talking about. If you are a drenger, we should tell stories of battle, swill a cup of mead around a hearth, and share our wisdom. You want some wisdom? 
Don't become a hero like I have. I'm cursed with this wallop. These children have made me curious. Your calm demeanor even more so. Oh, I beg you. There's no need for this to go where I feel you think it should. <laughs> you best depart unless you desire your face become a fist cave. Children, stop saying such things. I do not want to use it. I want to take on the wallop. I guess I don't have a choice. I truly wish to see this wallop. I will break it with my humble fists. Oh, neither of us will enjoy this, I'm afraid. You're finished! Oh, I'm tired. Down you go. Hmm. I've never been bested before. I'm shocked. Stunned. I never thought it possible. You have thwarted my wallop. You may have access to the treasure my wallop has sadly gifted me over the years. Sweet. Various awards for bashing skulls. Oh, still liberated of my legacy. Now I can live the normal life that has forever eluded me. Thank the heavens. The treasure right. What did I even get? His Bag of adorned teeth. Ocean of riches. Wow. Mm. The children kept... All right, off to the next one. All right, let's activate the sink point and then we'll go and get this. Okay, this seems like a fairly straightforward sink point. Get some arrows while we're here. <laughs> All right, let's go get us whatever that artifact is. Another straightforward one. Alright. As I say, we're going to come back to the raid a little later. Now for some more tricky ones. The world event. Okay, here we are back in Grant Bridge. And we're heading here. Looks like it's for some flighting. You, Dane, come closer. What do you want? You look to be a good fighter. But do you dare to face the greatest battle you will ever know? Of what do you speak? I speak of a terrible and monstrous incorporeal power whose name is feared across these lands. Fergal the Faceless. The most fearsome flighter in all of Grantbridge Shire. Ooh. Ooh. A flighter? Is that all? Fergal the Faceless has silenced doubters before. Will you challenge him? Indeed I will. I will face the Faceless. <gasps> My God. You are braver than most. Or perhaps more foolish. Come, I will give you a key. This key unlocks Fergal's lair, which you see now before you. That's a house. No, no. It is a den of nightmares. A pit of death from which few have ever escaped unharmed. By words. Unharmed by words. Go. Go now. And God be with you. Well, I really worked that up.
A new victim? What fool dares to challenge the might of Fergal the Faceless? Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor of the Raven Clan? My next meal. Are you prepared to be eviscerated with words? I think I will survive. I am Fergal the Faceless, and I am clever and strong. But you're not. You're ugly and weak, and you're a big smelly coward. You're probably too scared to even face me, now that I think about it. Sorry, have you started? Yes, obviously. I said you're probably too scared to face me. Hmm. But your rhythm is clumsy. You'll never outpace me. Ah, you think you can win with rhyme, do you? Well, if you like to rhyme, listen this time. I'm very brave. My flighting is grave. I'm not a knave, and it's victory that I really crave. Your tongue is fat. You're a sprat. You whine like a little brat. And we are in a spat. Interesting. Yeah, let's just All stick to life, that. All my life, I've not heard of a flighting so flat. Oh, you've made a terrible mistake. Be ready for my finishing blow. I am the best at flighting. I have got powerful skills. I'm strong as an ox and clever as a fox. I'm sharp as a dozen hawks. Let me show you my skills, and then you I shall kill dead with my... my skill. Wow. If we're arguing as to your talent, I shall happily die on this hill. You... Uh, well... I... Uh, just one moment. I, I... I need to think. Give me time. Fergal the Faceless or Fergal the Wordless? No, you get ready. The killing blow is... It's coming! It's... Fergal? Hello? Wow. He's run away. <laughs> well, that was terrible. Worst rap battle I've ever been in. At least we're up to level 2 charisma, which means some options of conversations will be now open to me, which could save me some money in the long run. Alright, what else we got? Several bits. Um, okay. Okay. Let's do this. These really annoy me. I have to chase some floating paper, which turns out to be tattoos. But they're just really frustrating. So it's up there. Location this. All right, got to get inside. Saga page collected. And we've got another piece of paper to catch.
Oh, we got that. Okay. Next thing to go for is this world event. My poor fields. Okay. God, why did you send so much vermin? Tough lands, old man. Those rats. I tried everything. I poured lye, I harvested locusts, I hired children to kill them. I need an army of miracles. They are pesky and have ravaged a good crop. Nah, the gods can't get at rats. Ha! You heathens and your gods. All I want is to rid my field of rats. Feed the fair folk of the Shire. You need natural warriors to keep them at bay. My poor fields. God, why did you send wow, so everywhere. much vermin? Lady with key. Shoo! Shoo! Stay Shoo. away from my castle! Away from my brood! What? I feel your army of cats have a destiny unrealized. Oh, cats. You are a Freya of the fence. What? Who the hell is Freya? Is she the whore that tried to eat my cat queen last week? Ah, so we're Charisma 2, which means we've got a conversation piece that is available to us. She is a great woman, much like you. She's a goddess, much like you, with pious and mighty cats that help her fight. Show your claws, good lady. Oh yes, mighty, that is what they are, and me, their goddess. Hmm. Hmm. She's nuts. If you want, use this key and see for yourself. Ooh, my pretty babies. So even AC Valhalla has a cat lady, and obviously a crazy the cat lady. Tut -tut. Fight your battle. All right. I have to be honest, I'm not a cat person. I like dogs, me. I like dogs. Alright, I think we need to speak to the guy again. Cats are sacred beings. They help keep harmony. Your rat problem has been taken care of. Pray to Freya. I never thought the meow of cats could soothe my soul. Take this key. In my house I have some goods. Please help yourself. People are so trusting in these times. I'm going to go and open this house and see what we've got. I doubt it's anything major. Probably just food and bits and pieces. If that. Ah, okay. Got a couple of supply bits. That's good enough. All right, let's add to our skill tree. Um, could start adding or heading towards some more proper skills like this one. Okay, what's the next one on our map? Let's have a look around, stay away from zealots. All right, we can go around this way. So let's go there. Okay, here we are for a world event. If I had my eyes, I would. Alfheimer, you say? Have you drunk a seer's concoction? No, I am as blind as they come. However, the light elves guide me through this realm, and I sense it. The path is fraught with delight. Energies the light elves dropped. And at the end, the third paradise. Wind blew. The wind blew. Higher than all the realms. Higher than Valhalla itself. I used the magic balls of Muspel, lit by the light elves to guide me. We will see the wind blew together. Okay. Yes. Illuminate the path into Elfheimer. Okay. Ah. Uh, I sense the light elves. You do? The luxury of their strong souls. 
Yeah, they are. What, what am I supposed to do? Oh, follow you. Okay, I, I will follow you. I hail from Zila. Joined Guthrum on his march through the swamps. I'm losing my eyes. They left me behind. Uh, here we go, we've got another one to light. Mm. Follow you again. Your family? Friends? They are back in Zealand. But no need. I have the light elves whom love and care for me now. And another one. Okay, so it's just a matter of Lighting the path. Got it. Straightforward. We are close. So are. close. From here, a final leg to this journey. Take the boat. Yes. This is the path. Too hot. Okay, that wasn't supposed to happen. Get off the boat. Yes. This is the path. Wind is across the Swan Road. I can see it. River Steed will be needed to cross. Can he just swim there? Can he swim? Yes, good. Because I seem to have accidentally set our ship on fire. Careful now. We don't want to attract any unwanted attention. Oh. The dark elves. How oh, they haunt me. What? You were right about those dark elves. Froden! The dark elves have returned! Spare them no mercy! Burst their skulls into small crumbs! Cut the dark ears off! Please let me find the wind blue! Is it more? There must be more then. There. That is Freyr's castle. Keeps court in there. Indeed. Until the Dark Elves came. Okay, this is proving to be a little bit more difficult than the others. Okay, he's got a little yellow thing on the top of his head, which means he's got carbon. Yeah, that's a bit of wealth. He just sent me here to kill all of these because they're in blue.
This turned out to be a little more exciting than I thought it was going to be. You can have your wind blue now, in peace, old Drenger. Ah, yes. The realm is safe. For now. Hey, Drenger. Okay. Got another world event. Okay, so here I am for the next one. Now this is a mushroom symbol. Which is Fly Agaric. Which basically means there's drugs here, which is these. I'm going to take them and get high. Observe the signs and light the right brazes to be able to pass through the gate. So I'm guessing that's the gate. Got to light the right brazes. Now, you got to look around and figure out which the right ones will be. So, from where I'm standing, this brazer has some rocks behind it. This one has a kind of gateway behind it. Also that one. That has just rocks and that has a gateway. So I'm guessing gateway. Let's try that out and see. So if I light all three of those. Well, portal's active. Let's see if that works. Fire is a blessing to one who has traveled far. There we go, that seems to have worked. To he who enters from the cold with frozen legs in need of food and clothing. Perfect. Fly Garrick done. On to the next one. This is the next one. But I'm not going to do it. Now, this requires a very high power or at least i prefer to have a very high power if i'm going to try it this is one of the daughters of larion so this one is going to stay undone until i am much higher up and we're going to come back and do this because we want to do all three of them there's three daughters so we're going to do all three of them and we're going to follow the route to obtain um a particular Weapon. I'm not going to mention too much about it just yet. I'm going to come back to that at another point. So the next one we're going to go for is this one here. All right. So here we are for the next one. This is another world event. Eden, this is a place. Hey, monk. No need to brag of your faith. Have you recently tested your faith? Considered the holy path. It is a better way, I swear to you. I am content with my gods. Not as content as I am with mine, I am sure. He allows me to avoid rage. I am never angry. Never. Good for you. Without anger in my life, I am completely changed. No longer obsessed with riches like you. They are meaningless because he loves me. Go ahead and burn my house. Destroy my belongings. I will never get angry. Heathen, okay. This is a place you seem lost and homeless. Make of mine what you will. What can I burn? burn it to the ground and it will not change me. Okay. That's Go great ahead stuff. and slaughter my livestock. It is not something I wish to do, but I would gladly allow you to do it. You see? I you know what? Angry. I bet this is Make one of those where it's, it's not actually his stuff. You will soon change from your pagan ways. And all of this homestead, the livestock, this is all yours. They are not mine. I have converted to God, and now I share all things. Yes, I mentioned that. Go ahead, destroy more. My faith cannot be broken. Thank you, Lord, thank you, Lord, for sending this devil to test my faith. Mm. Heathen, this is a place for proud converts like myself. I seek 
Okay, so let's set it on fire then. That didn't even work. Burn it down. Make a pyre of the past. Curious, good man. What were you before you became so devout? I can't get in here. So is, is there no key around? Before it is too late. Too late? For what? The eternal buckery you possess? And now you stand. Ooh. I worry that stool is covered in shit. What is this? Oh no, that's... I mean, that key. Do what you like with it. Throw it in the room. This hut Oi. reeks. What? As if a battlefield. Corpses. Dead people. These are other converts or your past crimes. You desecrate my integrity by insinuating such. But my faith cannot be desecrated. Praise be to my lord. Praise be to nothing. What crimes lie beneath your veil of Christ? What crimes have you gotten away with? You are no convert. You are a filthy opportunist. The church gave you riches. I am a strong, Christian, mild-mannered man of the cloth. My pagan past is gone. I am... A hypocrite. Without a shred of honor. You should pay for your crimes. People die unjustly in your newfound faith. Kill I him. gave you a chance, heathen. I am a better, richer man for what I did. I changed course and... Fuck it! I Ooh. am still the blood-hungry whore I once was. Fucking die, you putrid shit-eater. Die a thousand ways and times like the others. You would have sworn an oath to a pile of shit, you liar. Full of false pride. You should be judged at an alding for your crimes. Damn it. He's just a priest. Those willing to give everything away are those who have taken too much. Hey! My raven looted for me. Thank you. Okay, that's done. That was a bit of a weird one. It was very rude. But let's go grab this. Oh, but first. Okay, let's grab whatever this is. Uh, fight with reckless abandon. Partially filled adrenaline slot will not be affected by an enemy's first strike. Whatever that means. Okay, let's grab the wealth, which involves There's killing this guy. Hey, not getting away. Can I loot him? That's better. All right, let's get out of here before I get attacked even more. Let's head there. Got a world event to do. Oh dear. Over here, good warrior. That's messed uh, hi, up. stranger. Excuse me. I have a slight pain. Do you notice anything on my head? It's a, an itch or a cut that simply won't go away. It appears to be a, a battle scar. Ah, as I suspected. 
It must be from my most recent battle. You should see the other man. He got the worst of it. Worse than... I suppose it's possible, yes. If he is headless. My arms are numb from battle. Does it need any dressing? Do you think it is a serious wound? Well, <laughs> you have an axe in your head? It's really nothing, just a small cut. Let me tell the truth. You have an axe in your head. It is grim. I will take it out, but you will surely head off to the next realm soon. Ah. Valhalla it is. I appreciate your candid response. Now I prepare myself for the sights and sounds of the corpse hall. I will relieve you of the pain it gives you, send you down the Bifrost. It is time. You know, there's a great meeting. Let's do All it. your enemies have been slain. Now you rejoice. Grim, but fairly straightforward. Okay. And the next one is right here, so we're not going to have to go too far. Get us some snake stuff. Alright, where is it? Oh, one meter. Ah, oh, there it is. Again, easy enough. Roman artifact collected. Right. Our next stop is here. And then here. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Hey, child. Your home is cursed with shit. I wish I could laugh, but... I cannot. Yes, that rank odor is from the devil. The devil who produced me with this prick. Oh, that smell. He dips his arrows in cow dung and never washes. Says it brings him luck. We're doomed to choke in father's shit house. The cow dung he keeps is in those crates. It has mutated into the most unholy of pungent monsters. Oh, oh. What the hell? There are some seriously like weird events in this thing. Okay, so they want to get rid of some of these. So is this it? Just take out boxes. These berries are the only thing keeping me alive in the face of such a Ooh, vile coming smell. back. Easy now. Something's not right. How many are there? Oh man, wait, hold on. There's a zealot. Okay, so we ran into a bit of a glitch, uh, but I've restarted the game. Um, I don't know if that means I've got to start the whole mission again. Let's have a look. Yes, I do. Ah, oh, he's come back again. Yeah. Smells like a trap. Wonderful. The house is habitable. The stink from those crates is gone. But in my experience, if you do not cure the source, shit returns. My father dig alas. He's a famous archer, but he never washes. Never. I'm going to confront him 
that pox. Mother. So yeah, occasionally you come into a. Uh, that must be him. Occasionally you come into a situation where it says you have to be anonymous when you already are. Um, it usually glitches when someone that um, attacks you, that generally attacks you, shows up nearby, um, just like the zealot did. Uh, but now that he is nowhere near us, I had to restart the game in order to be able to do that. So. If you do play Father, the game and you run into that glitch, over. just restart. Our home is clean. You um, can stop sinking up the earth. Take a bath. I will one day get down, but my heroic odor will persist. It is what gives me my special powers. I can break powers. that with an arrow. God yeah. told me. Oh, another. Oh. Okay, I thought that glitched for a moment. That's a bit cartoony. I hate water. My coating is gone. My layer of sacred warrior shit has run off! What the hell is up with Mother, it? Sacred warrior shit? Father has been cleansed. Like really? Can I talk to him? Apparently not. That sounds like the zealot is nearby, which he is. Again, my beautiful Degolas. My love, you are finally clean. Our home also. So Come he's here, an my archer. Love. I can see your skin again. And his again. name is Degolas. That's... How does it feel to be clean again, Degolas? This clean feeling is strange to me. It's a little Lord of the rings -y. I was happy as a degenerate mudball. I never worried about these vain ventures. Your desires are not always those of your gods, your family, and your, well, those you lie with. I feel I've sold my war yourself. The grime inspired my bow. My shit arrows would strike fear into my foe's nose. Well, I'm certain your arrows will still fly true. You did not lose your archer's skill. Only time will tell. Be well, stranger. Sweet. Another one down. Let's just top up, build up our rations, another two skill points to add. Hmm. Light bow combo, hmm. All right. Let's go to the next location. We've got three more wealth to find, apparently. And they're all down here. And we have one more, sorry, two more mysteries. One of them is this one, which is the Daughter of Larian, which we're not going to do. And the other is this one, which I can't be bothered to do fishing at the moment. So when I get around to it, when I've built the fishing yard with a fishery or whatever it is um, over in Ravensthorpe then I'll come back and do that so that leaves just this which looks like cursed land and then this raid and then we're done for this episode all right so here we are Something's wrong. foul cursed Okay, that didn't work. Need to be careful here. Did I set myself on fire? What did I do? Okay, that was straightforward. Maybe it was the toxic smell that was causing me damage. I thought setting it on fire and getting rid of it would help, but apparently not. Okay. So we've done all of the artifacts in this area. The two mysteries we've already discussed we can't do, so let's go grab this wealth. I'm gonna fast travel. Okay. So here we are. We're in a distrust area. Let's give a quick scan. Highlights everything for us and let's light it all up. These are the items that we want. 
and we need to be in raid in order to do it. So now that we're here, there's one over there, one seems to be here in this tower, and one over there. So let's, got a lot of churches, let's start our raid. So here we go. Here's we need a key. Gonna show us an ally. Why? He's doing that. Right, there's our key. Okay, ran in the wrong direction. Ooh, that was good. Nice. Got the key. Let's get our ability. Mark of Death. So that's an upgrade. Yes, we're now level two with Mark of Death. So the upgrade increases the maximum number of targets. Excellent. I don't usually use that. Alright, let's get to our next location, which is just in here. We're gonna need someone to help us open the door. So take your time, we're only in a raid. and a bit of silver and the next one is in here we've got some people in here that we need to fight Help me out here. Finish. Good tag team, Dag. Give me a hand with this. completed. Don't know why I just feel the need to uh, Thank you, my friend. let some of our people out. So having looked at that now, we've completed everything except for those two mystery items which we will come back to at some point. We've highlighted everything. We have all the sync points. Haven't done the zealot. I'll get to him at another point later on. So that's the end of this episode. So once again, thank you for joining me for this episode where we have now almost completed fully Grant Bridgeshire. 
and join me for the next episode where we will pledge our allegiance to the next location. If you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell which will notify you when my next video is available to watch. So until next time, stay safe and happy gaming. Thanks for watching.